All right, hey guys, we are back for another episode of Pick a Fit. It's real turnt yet again. We've got a handsome fella next to me. This is my friend Noah. Hello. He is not new to the canoe club, uh, photography world slash YouTube world, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But I'm really happy to have him here. I don't think we've done a video together. Last was our first with Gannon. You also know Gannon. That's right. We're keeping it in the family. It's good. So yeah, a bunch of handsome guys in the room right now. We're gonna do some good pick a fits, and hopefully YouTube loves it. So fucking let's peek. Let, let's see it. <laughs> <laughs> so I was gonna say let's peek at it. All right, hey guys. So I have the pick here from my man Noah. Last episode, it may have been last week or maybe the week prior. I picked like a tonal fit for Gannon. It was kind of like a crew, beige, white, like they're like natural materials. So I'm kind of sticking with that because I think it's kind of cool right now. So I've got like an olive, olive drab, slightly grayish kind of worked in. But yeah, it'd be cool for Noah. Um, he's like a taller fellow with like longer legs and arms. And so I know that some of these are going to kind of like accentuate that and this new jacket in particular will look nice. So. Yeah, let's just hop into it from top down, which I think is how I typically do it. Cool hat from Manastash. He's got long hair, so hats look cool uh, with long hair in my opinion. Um, yeah, I don't know, it's cool. Beige and green, I bet you can guess why I chose that. And then this was really kind of what I worked the outfit around, is this new uh, leather suede jacket from Harmony that's priced very well. Um, and yeah, it just feels nice. It's not a super like roomy jacket by any means. I would say it probably leans on like the slimmer kind of like tailored kind of tip, but um, gonna wear it open. I think it'll still look nice. Uh, I typically kind of go big, but this will look nice open with this underneath. I definitely slept on this work shirt from EG personally. Uh, I like engineered garments in my own personal wardrobe. Um, kind of the thing I wait for every season, but I thought this would be cool and it kind of works with all of these tones uh, and it's kind of fun to work something in that I don't necessarily uh, feel like drawn towards but I think it's going to look nice in this outfit uh, and I'm excited to utilize it. Then lastly are these Mihara sneakers from uh, Nigel Kayborn collaboration. Um, kind of like cut in half. I like that they're not super chunky like they're a little sleek kind of like sophisticated looking. Um, and then they're gonna go with these Visvim pants. Uh, so these Mihara sneakers kind of cut in half. Nice and low, which will look nice, kind of like lend to like a summery look. You know what I'm saying? And then on the bottom are these Viz cords. Just like slightly uh, repaired, a little distressed, but again, kind of fit within the color palette and with them being sort of pressed is gonna look nice and sleek and slim paired with the jacket and it won't be too much of like a fitted jacket, big pants situation. So there's pants on the bottom. But yeah, so that is that. I think it's gonna look really cool. Um, kind of an outfit that I would wear for whatever that's worth. But I think Noah's gonna look probably better in it too. He looks better in any outfit, honestly, so. Where, where do you see him in this outfit too? I see Noah wearing this outfit maybe to one of his like gallery shows that he has coming up. He's an artist and I know that he's got like, he's like got some stuff planned. So I can see him rocking this kit, like looking sophisticated, yet still with like a sense of style, you know? Also, it could be something if he ever finds himself at like, I don't know, the Kentucky, the Kentucky Derby wouldn't be a good one, but like the rodeo or something. Again, kind of like an outdoorsy fit. We have like a little bit of a Western inspiration here with this leather jacket, but I don't know. There was a rodeo happening down the street the other day uh, outside of Denver, so maybe he could find himself at one of those. Um, but he'll look good wherever he wears it, so it's all good. Better hit this one out of the park, didn't he? 
Sheesh. What do you think? I like it. Um, my favorite color is green, so um, I love to be in green, beige, earth tones. Yeah. I feel at home in this fit. Um, the one, well, there's a couple things about it that are a little bit outside of my realm yeah. of like stylistic choice. Mainly how this cuts in here. Mm -hmm. um, it's a little bit more of like a Western fitting shirt, mm -hmm. but I like the proportions against the jacket from yeah. Harmony. Yeah, and like poking out so it's not jacket pant. Exactly. Know? Yeah. And um, the Visum pants are amazing. Also slimmer than I would normally wear, but um, they're super comfortable still. And uh, the hat too is like a cool, it's not necessarily something I would choose for yeah. myself, but it's a cool way to break it down into something more casual. Yeah, yeah. Or give it another feeling of like, you know, I could take this, I could take the jacket off and go up the mountain. Yeah, money. Type of thing. Yeah, so, yeah. Yeah, no, I would. Uh, and the shoes are sick. When I saw them for the first time, like when we got them, I was like, all right, those might be like a hard, hard to wear shoe. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Because they're definitely like, different in a very like severe way kind of like bowling shoe in the back almost but they they work perfectly like i don't look at them and think like oh my man's got some weird shoes on you know right I mean? like, no they, they they're cool they definitely are not like the focal point of yeah. the outfit yeah they, they blend in um to be pretty casual yeah i love this detail where the uh the laces yeah. wrap around the back I think yeah really it just cool. like makes it look a little different proportionally having the lace like come across your ankle where the sock is but What's the grade? I give it an A. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. I give it an A. Yeah. Especially because it's green. Yeah. That's all. That sells me. You know. Yeah. Dope. I mean, yeah. It looks really cool, man. Like, yeah. I did a good job on this. Thanks, one. Uncle Cheddar. Thank you. You're welcome, Uncle <laughs> Cheddar. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? I am Noah. Um, thank you to the Canoe Club team for having me today. I'm gonna pick a fit for Chase and. Um, I decided to go a little conceptual with the fit today because we all know Chase is a, a handsome and talented, creative young man. And we share uh, a passion in painting, uh, him with sign painting and me with making paintings. So I wanted to do sort of like a, a house painter type of fit today. Um, growing up, it was a thing my family and I did as well as roofing in the summer. Um, so. Just wanted to make some some workwear sartorial choices uh, to to go along with that idea. And so up first is this Nigel Caborn blazer. Um, it's got like classic workwear details like these red bar tacks, the Ecru cotton flows really nicely, and I think it's a way to sort of dress up this outfit while also maintaining a utilitarian sort of feeling with uh, the pockets. We're gonna pair that with this Lady White tee in a sort of tonal idea. Um, probably have him tuck it in just so if he was ha painting a house, you know, you, you wanna sort of get all the frills out of the way. Um, and I, I also like the idea that both of these are like canvas colored, and so really chases the art piece here. He's a, he's a blank canvas for, for the job. And then next up, I've got these denim shorts from Capital. Um, again, with the crew hits on the side with the bone embroidery. Um, we're both Midwestern boys, so cut off shorts are, are very familiar to us, and so I'm hoping Chase feels right at home in these. And then the, the whole idea of the fit really was around the idea of wearing boots and shorts. If you're gonna be on the job, you want something sturdy and you also wanna be flexible down here so you can climb up, up and down ladders, do what you need to do. Um, I really love these Hinder Scheme boots modeled after a classic Timberland. Uh, they've got a beautiful uh, raw leather and you should work in them because that's that's what's gonna get that nice patina and aging going on. To pair with those, we've got these anonymousism socks. Um, I like how the pink and the ecru sort of tie back into the jacket and the t-shirt, as well as some of the pink tones in the shoes. Um, probably have these bunched around the around the footwear. 
And then... Um, We've also got this Marnie beanie to complete the tonal thing. Uh, after the job, it might be nighttime by the time he, he's done, so he would uh, put this on. It's, it's light enough weight to wear on a summer night, and it's got these really cool distressing details as if it has been worn and worked in for, for years. And to finish everything off, we've got his fashion tool bag here. Keep all of his supplies in. Um, the brown and the accru here on the stripes also ties back into the, the tonal color scheme of the whole fit. So we'll have him put it on and see if he likes it. Big boots. What do you think? This is tight. Like it's it? definitely like not what I would wear personally. You Absolutely. know what I mean? We're talking like all the color. There's no like dark color like grounding it, which mm -hmm. is what I would personally do, but this is dope. You like and, it? and like conceptually it makes sense. Yeah. I like you tied in like the painting and yeah. if I were like on a paint job right now, like I, I could get work done. Yeah, you know you what I mean? There you go. Yeah. Will you uh, take the jacket off for a second just to see what we what we got going on. This is very, this is very Midwest summer right here. Oh yeah, I mean, I can name like 15 kids I went to high school <laughs> with that like, this is what they're wearing somewhere in Ohio, right this exact moment. Just right, like, but a little bit, you know, elevated like, version of that. Uh -huh. Hometown, hometown uh, hero type shit. Yeah, yeah, but this is cool. And these, these Capital shorts are dope. I think yeah. they, they like work perfectly for Capital and kind of fits this whole shtick right here. But yeah, yeah, I mean, also in full transparency in my real life, which is outside of this life right here, YouTube life, I have these Timberlands and they're dope. So I'm happy you went with oh. them. Like, it works with my whole. Nice. We'll have to see, how, how long have you had them? Four months, five months. Nice. I kind of keep, I've kept them on ice though, because I, I don't want them to be like too like, messed up in the winter. You know? Oh, okay. I was gonna say, in two years, you gotta do a side by side with the new Yeah, 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 yeah. Right now. yeah. Cool, what's the grade? I'll give you a B. Yeah. I'll give you a B. Cause I probably wouldn't rock around like all day, like in my real life with totally. this. But like, maybe I would, if I was doing some roofing. Yeah. Or cleaning is, my gutters. This is a dress up, like fantasy land sort of fit. Okay, this is a, yeah. This is like a created character type of fit. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah, 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 yeah. And you're standing like you. this and just stuff switches out. Exactly. I just wanted to see you in something a little different. Yeah. So, no, I like I'll it. I'll take it. I'll take the beat. Yeah, what's I would probably agree. I would I would consider throwing on like a jumbo hoodie over this instead of the jacket. Yeah, yeah. To make for more of a, Now like seeing it on. A casual uh, type of fit, but, but yeah. Thanks for trying it on. Yeah. Thanks for being here with me. We got a... Oh, fuck yeah. Ooh, ah, uh, frick yeah. <laughs> Ooh, frick yeah. <laughs> All right, that was our pick a fit for today with me, Noah, and you, Chase. There we go. <laughs> um, like, comment, subscribe. What else do they need to do? Yeah, uh, let us know like your thoughts. What else could we do with Noah? You know, like, is there like a brand you want to see him styled in or another? series like you'd see you'd like to see him participate in um yeah bring me back here I bring this boy here. back yeah it's good it's good to have the man in here so yeah bring him back and yeah just uh thank you for watching and always commenting and being nice and supporting us so feels good <laughs>